Introducing the most massaged muscle in history, the upper traps. Overactive, tense, painful, influenced by stress, poor respiratory patterns, posture, eye pads, and so on. So what's the cure for the tension and pain commonly felt between your neck and shoulders? Do we need to relax these muscles? And is doing this a bad idea? Research tells us that persistently tight muscles are often weak and fatigued. They may have become tight and painful due to a lack of initial strength when performing physical tasks. But perhaps more commonly, it's often due to persistent low loading and a lack of either significant rest or significant loading stimulus. The muscle just keeps trudging along with neither stimulus or relaxation. An interesting study by Anderson et al. 2008 reported on the identification of changes in muscle fibre types in patients with trapezius pain. They specifically noted unusual type 1 slow twitch muscle fibres which were typically over twice the size of normal type 1 muscle fibres and with a poorer blood circulation. They termed these large dysfunctional fibres megafibres and noted a clear association with their presence and pain. So what can be done? Well, in a latter study by Anderson and colleagues in 2014, they reported on the success of their trapezius strengthening program for their study group who demonstrated positive changes in muscle morphology, capillarization, and pain reporting. Using the evidence and clinical experiences, I would suggest trying the following. Strengthen the upper traps to reduce the pain and combine this with treatments like massage, stretching, and relaxation techniques. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment below if this approach has worked well for you.